it's been a while since I actually um, tried something different on this pack. So this is a little 12 volt kettle that I bought on eBay um, ages ago, and it's pretty pants really. Yeah, it's pretty poor. It's just got a 12 volt element inside. Um, so I'm just gonna open open it up. He says. It's just one of those little, oh, little 12 volt camping elements inside and it's sealed crudely in. So I'm just I'm going to run this and see how much current it uses and how much power it takes out of my little battery pack to boil two cups of water. So I'm going to plug it in and see how it goes. Now this isn't fully charged, uh, I accidentally knocked it and uh, reset the uh, capacity to 36 amp hours. So um, 11 point... 3 amps, 140 watts, and the cat's going nuts. I'm trying to get this to focus on it. 11 amps. It's a, a funny light, and the phone doesn't like it. So we'll see how long it takes to boil. A little red indicator to show it's got power. I didn't really notice it the first time around, but I didn't really use it that much. And the, the bubble's coming off the element. Nice. Uh, it's taken the chill off the water already, and it's been a minute, I suppose. Cat's going nuts. Okay, we've just reached 20 minutes. It's not quite a rolling boil, but it's definitely good enough to uh, uh, make tea with. So that's two cups of tea, 20 minutes, uh, and we've used, uh, wow, four amp hours of our usable capacity. So that is, obviously, come on, little camera. 11.2 amps, 138 watts. 32 amps left. Wow. So you could make a few cups of tea on this, but you wouldn't want to be doing this constantly. I mean, maybe an emergency situation when, if we lost uh, electricity and gas, this would be an idea. Though I have got a one kilowatt travel kettle, which I can use on in my inverter <coughs> out there. So, I mean, it's an idea. It's a test. I've had a play. I'm fairly happy with that. Not going to use this as a, as a permanent thing. The cable is hot. Yeah, so it, is, it can be done with my little pack. Uh, maybe when I introduce my uh, 60 amp hour pack, we might be able to use it on that from time to time. But yeah, not something I'd particularly take camping because I can just make fire. Fire's easier. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe, comment, or rate, and I'll see you in my next video. Cheers.